Hello there, a quieter end to the night to come. The wintry showers are easing away, as are the winds, which have been a feature of the weather throughout the weekend. And so a much colder start on Monday morning and potentially as well an icy start where the surfaces are still damp because temperatures not just in the air but on the roads will be close to freezing. And you can stay up to date with the warnings as ever on our website. Good morning, Carol. Scotland, Tullock Bridge had 12 centimetres today. Any snow in Scotland is going to be on the hills only. And as we go through this week, it's going to be mild for a time, but wet and windy midweek with some snow in the north at times. And then it turns colder with some frost. Morning, morning, Carol. Good morning, everyone. It is a chilly start if you haven't yet ventured out. There's a touch of frost across parts of Scotland, northern England and the Midlands in particular. But as we go through the day, temperatures, maximum temperatures will actually be above average for the time of year. Then as we head towards the middle of the week, it's going to be wet and windy. There'll be some snow showers, even at modest levels across Scotland. And then we get into a cold northwesterly to the latter part of the week and into the weekend. So all of us will notice the difference and there'll be some night frosts as well. Good morning. It's a cold and for some a frosty start to the day, but there's a fair bit of sunshine initially. But cloud in the west is travelling east with some rain through the day and later some heavier rain is going to come in across the northwest. <laughs> Thank you, Sal. Good morning, everybody. It's been a cold start to the day and you can see from some of our weather watchers pictures, beautiful though, some lying snow in the highlands this morning. This picture taken earlier in Dalroy. But again, a lot of sunshine to start the day, especially in central and eastern areas. This beauty taken in Lincolnshire. 